Yo, what is up guys? You guys know it's me, Say Shimmer here guys. And today is this is gonna be my last video for today, considering that you know I'm pretty tired. So yeah. By the way, tomorrow I would also I uh so I, I need to make a little bit of announcements. So one thing I want to announce is that the what ifs I'm gonna be doing in the future, I'm only gonna be doing two and not three, considering that three takes a lot of energy from me and also like it also makes me post crazy every single day to upload those three series which uh is like a lot of for me to handle like once once i'm like you know all equipped to this and you know i'm you know i'm used to this i will be post like more i will post three series but like until then i'm only gonna do two series in the future so remember that I'm gonna let y'all vote for those two series, but anyway, guys, let's get started with this what if. Alright, guys, let's get started with this what if. As we start off with Naruto and Sasuke currently training in the woods, as Naruto and Sasuke are pushing themselves, they're going, they're pushing themselves like to beyond their limits. Like Naruto is pushing past his limits so hard that he's literally almost at. I'm like I'm gonna say this like at the beginning of Black Clover, not even at the beginning. Like I'm gonna say. Naruto's been pushing himself really hard. I'm gonna say he's like, he's at least at the level of, mm, and strength. I'm gonna say he's currently around half Shippuden Naruto, which is already strong. He's literally at that strength. But like any further than that, like nah. Sasuke, he's literally entering Shippuden. He's entering Shippuden Sasuke, as Sasuke has learned about his lightning release as he's been pushing for to him to learn some new jutsus and he's been creating some of his own for example the the lightning spear which naruto which naruto and sasuke both created as naruto he's not able to do it but naruto has has you know taught sasuke you know gave sasuke an idea for it as sasuke is now able to like throw lightning spears at people by you know putting chakra into it and just throwing it at people which in hindsight that's like broken but like okay also sasuke has also learned how to uh, how to do one step of the shidori i'm just gonna say that sasuke is now he's at least able to do like he's like close to learning the shidori all he needs is for for kakashi to give him that one more tip and he'll be able to do the shidori or something else you guys don't know as naruto didn't do some hand signs as he doesn't like doing them much but he you know just does them as Naruto wouldn't say, fire style, fireball jutsu, as suddenly nothing comes out. As Sasuke, he'll just be, you know, chuckling. As Naruto didn't even put chakra into it, he just, you know, he just wanted to copy Sasuke, you know, making mockery out of him. As Sasuke, he, you know, gets embarrassed, but he, like, he's still happy. As... Naruto and Sasuke will keep on training. We're gonna do a time skip to at least a week, bro. I'm giving them a week. Bruh, Naruto and Sasuke, they're at levels. Sasuke is currently Shippuden level, Sasuke. And Naruto, man, Naruto, he is literally, like, he's literally... Like he's still in that Shippuden phase, like he's still in Shippuden, but he's getting close to being at least equal to the power of um. I'm gonna say like mm, Naruto in the beginning of Sage training. Like he's he's getting close to practically like Senjutsu Naruto levels, even though he's even though he doesn't have it. So like yeah, Naruto's got a major buff. Also, Naruto has learned a lot of moves. And I mean a lot. However, he refrains from using some of them, considering that when Naruto used one of them, it nearly killed Sasuke. And that's only because they barely. That's and the only like literally that's only because they like it missed Sasuke. But just by almost hitting Sasuke, Sasuke nearly died. 
as Naruto would make sure that he keeps that jutsu on the wraps, considering that he does not want to kill Sasuke. As this would actually be the Dark Cloak Dimension Slash Equinox. As Naruto would have actually did this considering that he's been pushing a lot. So Naruto, I know what y'all saying. Bro, you're making Naruto too OP. You guys don't understand something. Naruto is pushing past the limits, bro. It doesn't matter what he's doing. He is pushing past the limits. As Naruto... As Naruto was able to nearly, like... Like, Naruto's now per... Like, he's putting that in a just-in-case scenario. Like, for example, like a threat, like, as if, um... I'm just gonna say, like, up to the Ninetales threat. Naruto would be able to. So, um, I'm just gonna continue on. As Sakura... I'm not getting into it. I already know some Sakura tards are gonna go after me, but, like... Mm, Sakura, she, she, I'm trying to figure it out a way for her to be useful, but like, you know, currently, currently she's too obsessed with Sasuke currently until she learns the lessons. So yeah, Kakashi, he's been having free, he's literally just been, he's almost done reading for the, for the freaking, like, I don't know, 100th time make out parrot, like make out paradise. Cause bro, this man ain't stopped reading as Sasuke, Sasuke also has an appearance change. As Sasuke, instead of wearing that freaking, you know, how he looked in canon, Naruto, Naruto actually, you know, told Sasuke that he looks too fancy and, you know, that's not Shinobi-like. So Sasuke actually changed his appearance. He put on a black jacket with a, uh, with some, with a, with a uh, black shirt. Also with the with black shinobi sandals and also with the gray pants and he doesn't have those little shoulder the the little things that he put on his arms those little things he doesn't have them also sasuke carries a small little blade the same one that kakashi had when he was younger so he looks like a miniature version of shisui except you know he doesn't have shisui's air hair but yeah as you know kakashi kakashi is not like in you know kakashi's been been like you know now waiting for them to finish up their training as they're right now going off for their final day to protect Tazuna. Hey, this we're gonna do a time skip to when they're on the bridge. Gato would attack, and I'm not even gonna get into that because Naruto and Sasuke they slaughtered them easily. Naruto didn't even have to try against these guys, which sort of made Naruto disappointed. However, knowing Naruto or Yami in this case, he would push past the limit even like he would literally be like all right sasuke we have to defeat these guys in 10 seconds no not even that how about five as sasuke would then say one second as naruto's like yeah let's push past our limit as you know kakashi is like you know thinking like damn these guys remind me so much of guy like now he's getting like goosebumps because he's not thinking that naruto and sasuke might wear that that jumpsuit and he's like oh hell no fam as Naruto and Sasuke, they'll be able to finish him off in at least, uh, so I'm, I'm gonna give him to two seconds. As Sasuke and Naruto, when they were done, Naruto was a little bit disappointed, as well as Sasuke, considering that they couldn't defeat them in one second. However, they, they did push a lot, so they were at least okay with that. After that, Naruto decides that he's gonna go, you know, he's gonna go have some fun. As when they return back to Konoha, yes, yes, another time skip. Naruto on the way there, he would actually, I'm going to say this, on their way there, they would encounter some gambling areas. And Naruto, he would go over there. And let me just say, Naruto's luck is almost as bad as Tsunade's. Alright, this man Naruto literally always freaking gambled everything. And literally... He would end up getting out of the tavern completely naked. The only thing that he has left is a leaf that's covering his private parts. As Naruto would then say, Oh, don't worry, next time I come back here, I swear I'm gonna get you next time. As Sasuke, he... Although Sasuke knows that's pretty dumb, he still does, he does the same with Naruto. Sakura, she would always scold Naruto, telling him that he's stupid for doing that. But Naruto, he would just say, he would not even listen to her. 
bro, and Sasuke, he would accompany Naruto in this sense. Sasuke, Sasuke didn't do what Naruto did. However, he was considering it. Like, Naruto has pushed Sasuke far enough, so Sasuke is, you know, practically almost to do anything that Naruto says. As, <laughs> when walking back, every, the guards who were at the front gate, they were embarrassed to see Naruto. Naruto didn't even have his katana, bro. Naruto didn't even have that. As Naruto batted his katana on it. <laughs> as they were embarrassed. As Naruto walked in the entire leaf village butt naked. As everyone in the village had to cover their eyes. As they are like indecent. And my innocence. But Naruto's like oh, screw you. <laughs> as when Naruzen got the knock at the door. As one Ambu you know opens in and tells him to come in her reasons literally jaw will drop he's like ah i'm gonna freaking die as naruto will walk, as he would see naruto's um <clears throat> not going into that as he will be like my my humanity my my semblance for a man as he's now questioning his manhood as naruto is like yo her what's up as you know, Haruzen would then get back to, <clears throat> you know, go back to his posture. As he's like, so Kakashi, uh, care to explain why uh, Naruto is like that? Also explain how about what happened in the mission. As Haruzen would then order some Ambu to get Naruto some clothes. As Naruto would have gotten a fresh pair of clothes. As Naruto would actually have a dark cloak, like a, a black cloak, uh, a t-shirt. And also, uh, Yami's, Yami's pants, practically, what, again, what y'all, like, practically Yami's regular pants. So, Naruto would've gotten his original drip, but with a little bit more drip. So, yeah. As, Kakashi would not even want to explain about what happened to Naruto, as he just explains about the mission, as Harusen would understand. After that, Team 7 was, you know, dispelled, as Naruto and Sasuke, they were gonna go off to go train, as Naruto... As, actually, no, I'm not going to do that. Naruto and Sasuke are actually going to relax, considering that Naruto knows that pushing too much will, will you know, overdo it. As Sakura, you know, being jealous of Naruto, would then say, Naruto, baka! As Naruto would then turn around, he's like, oh, I didn't even notice you. What do you want, Miss Royal? As Sakura then grit her teeth, she's like, shut it! How about this? How about I fight you for my sasuke goon? And Sasuke is like, what? You know, he's like, what? I didn't get, I didn't even like you. And Sakura, she is now gone full fangirl, bro. She's going, she wants Sasuke. And Naruto's like, uh, okay. You know, he's just like being, so, you know, he's just being himself. So we're we're gonna, you know, we're gonna do a, we're gonna skip forward a little bit to when they're in the training ground. And Sakura, she is now confident. As she's so enveloped in her fangirl that it looked like her fangirl personality took over completely. As Naruto can tell that she obviously thinks that she's gonna beat him. And Sakura, she's currently thinking that Naruto is that Naruto may be strong, but the power of love shall overcome whatever the hell that is. As Naruto, he's not even gonna try. As Sakura, she will rush at Naruto, trying to deliver a punch and one second naruto bodied her not even going all out he just delivered a punch to her stomach and she was out like you cannot tell me that this man isn't a savage as naruto after taking care of that told sasuke that we're gonna go get some drinks and eat some ramen as you know sasuke would agree to this as naruto and sasuke would be right now drinking and eating some ramen as Naruto would just be chuckling and laughing. As we can see, as Sasuke, he is now, you know, thinking about everything that's been happening to him ever since he's been teaming up with Naruto and ever since, you know, everything. As he's now realizing that thanks to Naruto, he would never have gotten this strong. As he then looks back at Naruto and tells him, thank you. As Naruto's like, whoa, what is up with the emotion stuff? Hold up, Sasuke. Wait. As, you know, Sasuke is like, what? As Naruto's like, Sasuke, I'm sorry to tell you this, man, but I don't swing that man. I don't swing that way. As Sasuke is like, hey, yo, what? No. 
As Naruto just chuckles as he's like laughing as Sasuke would laugh as well. He has both of them continue drinking and eating until all until they finally end up leaving. Naruto would then tell Sasuke goodbye. Sasuke would, you know, say as well. As all of them go home. Naruto is now he is now, you know, tired and everything, so we're gonna do a time skip to the next day. In the next day, you know, Kakashi all like called T Team Seven for a meeting as he would then explain to everyone about the tuning exams and how it's going to be taking place. Sakura, who actually still got that, she still remembers that beating clear as day. She would not even look at Naruto. She does not even have the. She feels like she's pathetic that she does not deserve to look at Naruto. As Naruto can already tell this. As we didn't see as, you know, Kakashi tells them that he's gonna that he signed them all up and that they're gonna do it as Naruto and them would then, you know, just accept for joining it. As after that, Naruto and Sasuke they decide that they're gonna go train. However, something different would happen. Sakura, instead of being the little fangirl bitch that she was would finally ask Naruto if she can train with them. As Sasuke would then look at Sakura, as Naruto would then look at her, and he's like, well, sorry, Miss Royal. I'm sorry to say, but my training methods are not up to your, your girl standards. As Naruto, you know, would say this in a mocking tone, but Sakura, she wouldn't even care. She just says, no, please train me. As Naruto would realize that she's being dead serious, as, she, as he can read her key, as Naruto would then smirk and he's like, all right, come on. As Team 7 went and go. To Naruto and Sasuke's, or now Sakura's, training ground. As Naruto would then give Sakura the regular rundown of his training. And let me just say, it was a hell. By the way, so this time the teams did not meet Gara's team. And Konohamaru didn't run into Konkuro considering that he wasn't spying on Naruto. He was actually hanging out with his friends. Although he did want to meet up with Naruto at some point. But he was never able to find him. So, yeah. As we're going to do a one week time skip. Uh, actually, no, a two day time skip actually because of the tuning exam is in two days. Naruto and his team, bro. They Naruto practically just made a miniature version of the Black Bulls. As Sasuke and Sakura, like, bro, you cannot even joke around. Sakura, she is way, she is way different. Sakura, she's more hyperactive. She likes to fight. And she always, she's, she has like, I'm going to say that she's like luck in when it comes to fighting. Except, she, you know, she's not to the extent to beating them brutally and everything also uh she also has a how could i say this she has a when it comes to her you know being nice personality and everything she's has she has a similar version to noel a little bit like a little bit similar uh but however she's not like exactly like her and she also has also's fiery spirit just like sasuke uh, sasuke has also's fiery spirit when it comes to training so yeah as when they all enter the freaking tuning exams they would see a bunch of people blocking their path however they already know that it was again jutsu so they just move along as when they about when they're about to you know sign up rock lee would then challenge sasuke for a match as sasuke would then accept that sakura would be like oh sasuke why don't you let me fight him as sasuke is like how about this, Rock Lee? How about you challenge my teammate over here? Then you can fight me. If you can beat her. As, you know, Lee would then, like, look at Sakura, then look at Sasuke. So he'll be confused, but he'll then just agree to this. Although he did not want to fight Sakura. As he is going to hold back. However, he tells Sakura that he's not. As Sakura's like, perfect. As we didn't see, as when they fight, Sakura vanishes right from Lee's eyes. As Lee, he is shocked as he would then get a de devastating punch to the jaw. As his jaw would have been broken, bro. As Sakura would freaking punch Lee so hard, he, got, he literally almost destroyed the entire wall. 
as Lee would be coughing up blood as he's like, what? As Sakura would then turn up behind him, as she would then deliver a chop to Rock Lee's neck, slamming him into the ground, making another crater. As Rock Lee, he's barely conscious. As Sakura ends up grabbing Lee from, from his freaking head, pulling him up, as she's like, wow, that was so much fun. Come on, let's keep fighting. As she ends up throwing Lee straight to the other side again, as she ends up beating him up more and more. As Naruto and Sasuke, they witness this as they're like, wow, Sakura, you really know how to overdo it. As Naruto and Sasuke, they had to step in at some point, considering that Sakura was really about to kill this man. As Sakura's like, what? Naruto, you want to fight me? As Naruto's like, no. What? No. As Sakura's like, huh? Okay. Let's keep going then. As Sakura, she would then return back to her calm you know, personality and, and get out of that battle instinct as she would then go. As for Rock Lee, my guy showed up as he'll see Rock Lee as he's like, Lee, what happened? What happened? As Lee couldn't even talk as Neji and Tenten, they would actually be shocked about what happened to Lee as they're now terrified of Sakura, especially Tenten. She, wed she was like, hell no, I don't want to mess with her. So, yeah, she is now afraid. As when Team 7, you know, walk in and, you know, sign themselves up and go in, they'll see a bunch of Genin over there looking at them as Naruto's like, oh, wow, so scary. As Sasuke would just smirk confidently. As he's like, hmm, this shall be fun. As Sakura, she's like, oh, my God. Uh, as she's now, she, her battle instinct side or her, Crazy luck side, I'm gonna call it, is now beginning to kick up. But she's like, hmm, I wonder how I'm gonna beat up all these guys. But she's excited for a good fight. As we didn't see, as all the rookie nine didn't show up, as they end up, you know, greeting them, as, you know, Naruto and Team Seven would, agree, would you know, meet them as well. Ino, she immediately rushed to Sasuke, as Sakura, she didn't even care, considering that she doesn't even, you know, like she still likes Sasuke however she mostly sees like she sees Sasuke as a companion first as her love interest second so she really doesn't care as when Ino sees this she's like what Sakura you're jealous as Sakura she would just ignore her although she is now excited she thinks that you know what might put up a good fight so she's now getting pretty a bit excited Naruto would be talking to Shikamaru, and, you know, Shikamaru would be, you know, both of them would just be chilling. As Naruto will always tell Shikamaru that he's way too relaxed, and that, you know, he needs to begin to train more. However, Shikamaru is just not motivated. As, I'm gonna say that Shikamaru is like that cool, calm person of the, of, Nar of Naruto's friend group. Sasuke, he used to be, but, like, now, like... He's, he has that awesome fire spear for training, so yeah. After, so I'm going to do a, a skip forward because the exam was exactly the same except Naruto was actually able to answer the question and he didn't do that little announcement. So, straight to the forest of death. As we didn't see as Anko Midorachi, she would then explain about the portion of the forest of death. As all the getting there would all be prepared for it. Team 7 would not look afraid at all. In fact, Sakura, she has a smile on her face. Like a, like, you know, like a smirk, practically. No, like, I don't even know how to say it. I'm just going to say like a calm looking smile. However, that smile is just a way to hide her excitement for fighting. Because her, her luck instincts are kicking in instantly. She's ready for a fight. Sasuke, his, uh, his fighting spirit, which uh, he has that like he has a really good fighting fighting spirit. He is now excited. He's like, hmm, come on, let's go. Sakura is so probably how can I say this? Sakura, she has that you know that spirit to beat up her opponents, like fight powerful opponents, beat them up and beat them up brutally. Sasuke, he wants to fight them and win. So they both have that thing as Naruto. He's excited to push past his limits because he's considering that there's a lot of powerful people here. So he's going to be able to push past a lot of limits. As he's now excited, bro. He's like, oh, hell yeah, fam. I'm about to go off on these fools. 
as Naruto actually can sense something mysterious as he ends up looking right behind him as he'll then see a grass ninja as Naruto's like I sense darkness no I sense something malicious as Naruto would send this guy a dirty glare or a girl or whatever that is because Naruto can tell that it's a thing not a he or a them or anything it's a he is a thing so Naruto would just you know he would keep that in mind as you know as we then see as Anko would then tell them to sign the forms which all of them do as they would also get their scrolls as Anko would then begin the force of death as this is where my end the video <laughs> sorry guys i'm so sorry but i um tomorrow i will be doing that part but you guys are gonna have to wait until then sorry but anyway guys it is sage samurai and i am out peace